Hello my beautiful friends, it's Amanda here and I am back with another ColourPop video. They are launching a huge rainbow collection. Most of the things in this collection are re-promoted items, things that they have already previously released, but we've got a bunch of new bundles. We do have some new single eyeshadow shades and there is one new face milk from their sister skincare company, 4th Ray Beauty. That's the Acai Face Milk. This collection is dropping on Wednesday, August 14th at 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. I'm gonna do my very best to get this video out before the launch or as close to the launch time as I possibly can so that you can see everything before it goes for sale and you can decide what's really gonna work for you. I am mostly gonna focus on the eyeshadows, but let me just breeze through the other bundles for you. That way you get a complete picture of what this rainbow collection is all about. We have the Over Chromatic BFF Cream Gel Pencil Liner Bundle. The liner set is priced at 20 US dollars and it contains five liners. We have Crossed, the yellow, the purple one's called Piggy Bank, this blue one is Prance, orange is Puppy, and green is Electric Daisy. We have a BFF mascara set. This one's called Color Me Happy. It's priced at 40 US dollars. And this also contains five shades. There's the yellow mascara called Yellow Goodbye. The coral one that just came out with their summer collection, that's called Lover's Coral. The pink mascara is Pink Ink. The purple one, which is one of my favorites, is Purple Prose. And then there is a teal mascara called Kiss and Teal. We're also getting a foursome called Rainbow Rose. This contains two Super Shocks and two Jelly Munch shadows. That foursome's priced at $20. It has a green, neon green Super Shock shadow called Fizz and a bright orange one called Shy Guy. And then the two Jelly Munch shadows are the yellow called Origami and the pink one called No Rest for the Vivid. The fourth ray face milk set is called Head in the Clouds. It's priced at 35 US dollars. It comes with, you guessed it, five of the face milks. The new one is the acai. And then it also has watermelon, papaya, turmeric, and matcha. The last bundle I'm gonna talk about before I get into the shadows is this Mad About Hue brush set. This is priced at 20 US dollars. It has five brushes. The set has the small angled eye brush, the small tapered blending brush, the small shader brush, the blending brush, which this is like my favorite eye brush of all time, and then the small fluff brush. Okay, let's get to my favorite part. You guys know I love eyeshadows. I love ColourPop eyeshadow palettes. This is the She's a Rainbow palette. These are all singles that come in a large magnetic palette. The whole She's a Rainbow palette will be sold for 40 US dollars. We have seven new eyeshadow shades. Here's a close up look at the palette. This is very rainbowy. There are three pressed glitters in here. The pressed glitters are all existing shades. You already know I'm not a huge fan of pressed glitters, so there's only three in here, but I still just don't really like them too much. The seven new shades are this matte dusty pink. This one's called Worth It. This red matte shade called Brick Road. An orange matte called Hard Place. This minty pale pastel green. This one's called Looking Fresh. Then we have a really bright neon green. This one's called No Scrubs. This is a beautiful shimmery cobalt. This one's called Right Tempo. The last new shade is this purple shifting beautifulness. This one's called Hold Me Down. It's definitely one of my favorites. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you just some quick finger swatches of these seven new shades so that you can see what they look like on the skin. Here are the seven new shades. I know you guys probably wanna see some comparisons with these. I am gonna do that over on my Instagram stories. That way you can request the exact shade comparisons that you wanna see. So make sure you head over to Makeup Just For Fun on Instagram. I will be doing shade comparisons. 
Those will also be saved in my story highlights, so if you're a little bit late to the party, you'll still be able to see the other comparisons that other people have requested. Now let me point out the shades that are newly released as singles, but previously existed in palettes. Big Sugar is from the Ooh La La palette, and this one called Sandbar is also from the Ooh La La palette, but it was previously existing as a single shadow, so... This isn't new from a palette, but I did want to point out this one's also an ooh la la. Then this bright matte medium orange Sunkissed is from the Orange You Glad palette. This matte mustard shade called Totally Buggin is from the Aha uh -huh Honey palette. So Meta, this shimmering bright yellow, is actually from their Holiday palette two years ago. That palette was called the Chasing Rainbows palette, and that palette is still available, by the way. Then we have this really bright matte yellow called Sweet Spot. This one's from the Aha uh -huh Honey palette. Mary Jane is from Just My Luck. And then all three of these blues here are from the Blue Moon palette. We have this pale matte blue shade called Moonlight. Really, really bright shimmery blue called Tide Pool. And then this matte deeper bright blue called Fine China. All three of those are from the Blue Moon palette. Kittenfish is from the It's My Pleasure palette, as is this purple shimmer on the bottom called Do or Do. And here are some swatches of those singles that were previously only available in palettes. I didn't swatch this whole She's a Rainbow palette together, honestly, just because I don't want to swatch those pressed glitters because I I hate press glitter. But I am going to link you to some swatches of the entire palette from ColourPop Colt, so go check those out. So all the rest of the shades that I did not touch on, Sandbar, which I already mentioned, Centerfold, the three glitters, and this purple called Seeing Stars, those were already existing within the ColourPop Singles line. A lot of new shades, a lot of newly released as single shades, and just a few previously existing shades in this palette. If you don't have any of these shades, this can be a really good way to add them to your collection for a good value. I really want to touch on some eye safety just for a second. I know I harp on this a lot, but it's only because your safety and your health is really, really important. Definitely more important than eyeshadow palettes or makeup of any kind. A lot of these shades, not just in this palette, but also in the liners, are neons, reds, glitters. Anything with neon red or glitter is typically going to be marked as not eye safe or not for the eye area. Please, please read the warnings. Be aware of what you're using near your eyes. Sometimes it's totally fine and people don't have a problem. They don't have a reaction, but that's not the case for everyone. So just be aware take a look at whether they are eye safe or not, do some patch testing, and just make sure you take care of yourself. That's all I'm gonna say. Eventually I'll make a video all about eye safety and I'm gonna do a really informative, in-depth eye safety video, but that is not this video. I did just wanna mention it just because I care about you and I care about your eyes. Okay, that's all, that's all. If you wanna see a bunch more swatches, a bunch more in-depth info, I'm gonna link my friend Emma who runs the ColourPop Cult Instagram page. She is amazing, she's on top of it. She knows everything about everything about ColourPop. Please go and check her out on Instagram. She's really quick to swatch things on Instagram so you can check out her page for another reference. She's just absolutely fantastic. If you love ColourPop, you need to be following ColourPop Colt. She also has an actual affiliate code. So I have a discount code, but I don't earn any affiliate commissions from its use. But Emma does have an affiliate code. I'm gonna put her code down in the description next to where I link her Instagram. Definitely use her code, you can save 10%. It's a great way to support her page and she's just awesome. So check her out, use her code, ColourPop Cult for Life. If you know me, you know I love my ColourPop eyeshadows. So I'm definitely gonna recommend this palette even though I don't like pressed glitters at all. It's nothing against ColourPop's pressed glitters, I just don't like them. This is a great value. This is a really fun, bright rainbow palette. I love my ColourPop singles. I love that I can mix and match them and make little palettes all the time. So this is one of the things I'm absolutely gonna recommend from this collection. The other thing I wanna recommend is the Mad About Hue brush set. 
ColourPop brushes are very underrated. Their brushes are fantastic. I use their eye brushes all the time. I have like six of that blending brush. This one now makes seven, so I'm not mad about it. I use them every time I do my eyeshadow. This brush set is a great deal, great value. Their brush sets always sell out because they're so good. Okay, for those of you who stuck around to the end of the video, first of all, thank you. And I do want to do a little giveaway. Like I said, a lot of these things are re-promoted and I already have all the mascaras and all the liners. I want to do a little giveaway with the mascara and liner set. That's why I didn't take these out and swatch them because I want to give them to one of you guys. Check down in the description box to see how to enter. All you'll have to do is fill out a little Google form. So all the info about how to enter and when the contest ends and all that stuff will be down in the description box and it'll also be on that Google form that you fill out. So go and check that out. One winner will get some liners and mascaras and some fun colorful shades. I really love doing giveaways and being able to share makeup with you guys. It's just a small way for me to say thank you for watching, for supporting me. For those of you who follow me over on Instagram, I really appreciate that too. Time is really valuable and the fact that you take your time to watch something that I created really means a lot to me. So a little thank you prize here. There will be more giveaways in the future. I'm getting ready to move actually, so I might hold off on any more big giveaways until I get situated in my new house. But for now, this is a fun little colorful giveaway for you. Now's the time when I wanna hear what you guys think about this rainbow collection. Are you excited for these new shades? Are you kind of over the re-promoting old things and new bundles? I always love to hear what you guys think about things too. So please leave a comment, let us know. As always, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Editing Amanda, you know what to do. The, the, eh, what? Oh yeah, okay. If you know me, you, you, let, <laughs> my camera really is playing games with me today. I just shot a bunch of lip swatches and my poor lips are so dead. I'm fine. Thank you for support. <laughs> She's so eloquent. Struggle bus today. Struggle. Struggle bus. Blah, blah, blah. It's funny, I always get comments whenever I wear a tank top and people can see my tattoo. I always get so many comments that are like, whoa, you're, I didn't expect that from you. And I don't really know what to make of that. Like, what does that even mean? <laughs> I have a very large tattoo on my arm. I have a half sleeve. I know that you can't really see it that often in videos, especially because I'm usually wearing like a t-shirt, you only see so much of me, but yes, I have a very large tattoo. I don't know if I should be like insulted when people say that. I don't think people mean it to be insulting, but I usually kind of have this feeling of like, what does that mean? Like a lot of people say, oh, I didn't expect you to be the kind of person that has a tattoo like that. Like what kind of person has a tattoo like that? You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I mean, I guess now you're curious and you want to see it. It's pretty big. No, that's not my husband's name. That's my son's name. I've got a hibiscus flower, sunflower, a cladaw. Focus, focus. So yeah, I have a big tattoo. I have more than that too, so. I have two others that you can't see and I'm not going to show you. Just because they aren't in like a fully visible place. Calm, calm your dirty minds down, okay? Sheesh. All right, well, that's quite enough of that. Okay, thanks for watching. Okay, bye.